I bought TikTok shop cat products so you don't have to because I'm obsessed with my cat Reese. Aww. If you haven't shopped on TikTok shop yet, they give you a 40% off discount code for your first purchase. So I couldn't resist that, especially with the prices already low. And on top of that, with the discount code. They're definitely competing with places like Timu and Amazon. I know it's some of the same products, but there were more money on those places. So are these items any good? So let's do the small one first. This time he's up and awake, so he's gonna keep running away. Come on, maybe. Hey. Don't you wanna see your, your presents? Oh, okay, so we got a bunch of little goodies in this one, actually. So where do we start? Let's start with the first thing it showed, okay. This one is a cat brush. Okay, I did get in the color green because <laughs> Reese is a boy. I almost got the pink one, but I can't just keep getting girly stuff for him because he's a boy. He's, this one's definitely more manly, right? I got this one for his hair because I noticed that his hair always falls out and gets everywhere, like on my clothes or on the bed. I was thinking if I could do this every day, I hope it from shedding. Uh, when you press the button, it, I don't say, I don't even know what that does. Well, let's test it out. Come here. Let's bring his brother in, just because he doesn't have a sweater on right now. Oh, okay. So that's gonna probably push out the fur. See, I see the fur now. Probably push it out so he can throw it away. Okay, so you probably don't wanna press the button yet. <laughs> he likes it. Someone needs a bath. It just pulled his hair out. Look. I mean, it's working. That's what you're supposed to do. I do think this cat brush was worth it. I use it almost every day now. And it's great to groom them and get rid of their excess hair. Plus, they love the feeling of the brush against their body. It must give them a good scratch. Uh, now that we brush his hair, we can put on his sweater. I had to get him a sweater too, because Reese, he's not here right now, but he's at the window right now. But I got a sweater for him for my last video, my little Valentine haul. This time, I'm, I have to get him one too, his brother. <laughs> Again, it looks kind of small. I should have sized up. This is before I got even the other sweater. I ordered this one, so it's, I'm afraid it's gonna be a little small on him. Especially this one. This one does not feel like it's as stretchy. But I'm like, why not? While I was ordering all this stuff from TikTok shop, it was only like 90 cents. I'm like, why not? So this one I thought looked cute with his orange color. Let's try it on. It's always a struggle putting it on if they're not sleeping, of course. Okay, so it does fit. Okay, so it's not too tight. It doesn't look too tight. But obviously he's not foam grown yet. He's still a, little, a kitten, so he's gonna grow out of it. It's still gonna be cute till then. And while it's still cold this month. Okay, you can go somewhere else now. Cause he wants to go somewhere else. Next is, uh, let's see. I think this is the litter mats, if that's what it's called. It's supposed to like collect the litter. If you haven't seen one before and so you can put the litter back in the litter box so it doesn't waste it or so it won't be like a big of a mess. They always make such a mess. Probably show you guys later how it looks with the other item I'm opening. Hey. <gasps> he took the sweater off already. Bro. Yeah, this one, he doesn't like sweaters like reese usually keeps a sweater on unless i leave it on him i forgot to take it off of him but this guy he hates it there you are <laughs> so that was all the ones in the little package now let's open the big package this must be the one i had to build <laughs> There's so many so let's let's do this one first actually if i can get it out Oh my god, it's big. That's good. I didn't expect it to be this big, though. Holy crap. This must be their pet bed. I got, I got a big size, but... I mean, oh, it's not that big. Okay. Once you take it out, it's not that big. Look. It just looked big from that, from when it was folded. Put the pillow in. So this is their pet bed. Oh, it's upside down. Wait. Oh, shoot. Maybe if I um not have it upside down. Okay, now I can see it. See, it's this green I'm not sure what the animal is it's like a monster 
or as a yeah like a dinosaur probably because has a little horn i got a green one because i like the color green for them because they're boys anybody want to try their um new pet bed maybe you will now <laughs> come on come on right here look there's food in there bro they are scared they're always like that sometimes with new items. They aren't sure what it is. They're like, not gonna go in it. So I might have to force them in it. Here, baby, it's okay, look. It's okay. Yes, there's treats. I forgot how much it was, but it's a really good deal compared to the ones I see like at Walmart or like stores that they sell for so much, like I can get them cheaper somewhere else, right? And they're just going to destroy it anyway, so it doesn't have to be perfect as long as, you know, they're comfortable. But even though cats don't care about comfort, I've noticed, like they'll sleep on anything like cardboard because I bought pet beds before in the past and they just don't, they choose to go in a cardboard box instead of the pet bed, so... They're playing with the plastic bags right now. So they're not even interested in it. But I'll leave it right here in case they decide to go in it. But I think they're scared. I might have to move it though because now they're not going to go in the chair. I didn't try his brother yet. <laughs> he just, the sweater, he took it off completely, bro. We'll put it back on later, I guess. It's okay. and he's out okay whatever we're just gonna move on and i'll move this down here because he's not he doesn't want to go on it in it right now come on so the next thing i do have to build it's a litter box and he's gonna shake the camera really no I, I needed to get a new litter box for him um because the one they have is a little one and this one looks bigger and it comes with this scooper which is cool because i wanted to get a new one that's perfect hey baby uh i was i'm surprised you have to build it because i wasn't expecting you had to build a litter box so i'm used to get seeing the ones at the store but it was pretty easy to build once you figure out where things go you can always take the top off to scoop the litter and add more litter I think it was the perfect size for a normal size cat. I don't know about the obese ones. Now I gotta clean out the closet. So I can put it in the bottom. I really do like my new litter box and litter mat. They both fit under this abandoned closet. Brings us to the last item, I, I believe. I had to build this one too. Yeah, this is gonna be the bottom. So it's like a carrying case slash like a, uh, a cage you can use as well if you don't know already i don't live with reese so i don't get to see him as much as i would like to or put him in videos you know when i record my videos at my house so maybe i can he can visit my house so it's a safe way to bring into the house There he is. He's a little camera shy right now. Come here. He was just in it. But of course when I'm courting, he's not want to be in it. Come on. Come here. If he's not in it all the way, it does tilt. But maybe because he's still getting used to it, he'll go in there. Uh, for the most part, so far, he's just been, you know, loving me and trying to keep, you know, company with me because he has no one else here. Usually, he has his brother. But don't worry, he's going to go back home later. He doesn't really want to go in the carrying case. <laughs> but mainly, I'm using it as like a cage right now when I leave the room and I can't watch him. But... When my sister is here or my dad, I have them come in the room so they can watch him. So he's not alone. So he doesn't have to be in the cage then. Because I want to watch him because he, you know, he'll get into things and mess things up. Especially in a new environment, he's going to be exploring. Come back. They can't see you, honey. Come on. He does not like it. <laughs> but yeah, it's pretty big inside. 
and I feel like he could just lay down in there. It's mainly so he can lay down in it anyways. <laughs> but it's really nice quality, actually. It was $12 on TikTok shop, but with the 40% off, it was $9. That's a steal. Like, I seen it on TikTok shop for, like, up to $20 or $30 it was. And I found this one for the $12. I'm like, wow. I had to try it. And I definitely recommend it. If you need a carrying case slash cage, that could do both. So he prefers to sleep in my lap. He's so cute. So I didn't want to get up and put him back in his bed. But he does go in it still. He'll just have to get used to it, especially in this new environment. So I don't know if the prices are still going to be low on TikTok shop or when the sales are going to end. But all I know is I do recommend checking them out. I bought everything myself for Reese, my little kitty cat. I do recommend these items. Like all the items were pretty good and I worth it. It. those prices you just can't beat that nowadays you just you gotta get it um cheap and for cat products they don't have to be fancy you know maybe like the carrying case has to work and it does so far we'll see if <laughs> if it breaks over time i'll update you guys on that if you're interested yeah i'm happy with everything i got in this video and i think reese is too he probably wants to sleep now. Let me know down below what kind of videos you want to see of Reese. Because now I can bring him over with my new carrying case. And if you like this video, press the like button. And if you want to see more content from me, press subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.